What is going on, guys? This is Riv for Wolfpack Productions with another episode of My Favorite Game On. And today we're talking about the Sega Genesis. Now let's get right into the game that we're going to be playing, shall we? And for honorable mention, yeah, you saw it right. It's one of my personal favorites in the very first Genesis game I ever played. No joke. It's Michael Jackson's Moonwalker. Now, the story about that goes that my neighbor actually had this game. She'd let us play on her kids' Genesis, and they had this. <clears throat> this is like the first game I picked. Not Sonic. Not American Gladiators. This. Not Streets of Rage, but yeah, you get the point. You basically have to go save these kids. And don't use a spinning hat very much. It'll automatically take, it'll take off some life if you do. <laughs> I know the joke there, and I'm not going to make it. Yeah. What does that look like? Figure it out yourself, people. I ain't making that joke. Oh, you have to look at every door because you might have some somebody in there. You check up. You up will let you look at the doors. Some have nothing. Some have something. <laughs> I made as much sense as I wanted it to make. And B does your attack, by the way. Oh, boy. Michael. And then the last kid, I think, is in the chair here. Or in the door. <laughs> Once you get all the kids, Bubbles will co your pet monkey Bubbles will come point you to the right place to go. Which in this case, I wasn't very far off of it. Watch this. He can hurt you, by the way, without even having to do anything, but... I just want to show you all this. Watch this. I was trying to pull off the dance move, but it didn't do it. You have to have a certain amount of magic to do it, because it eats up a heck of a lot of it. <laughs> it's either that, or you have to be holding A and B long enough. Oh! Or, oh! Or whatever it is. I think you can make him moonwalk, too. I can't remember how, though. Found a kid over there. <coughs> See, this is why you check every door. Oh! Going up the stairs can be a pain. I think the main reason now that one, this is one of my favorite games is it because it's just because it's a really unique experience, but because of the music. Yes, these are real Michael Jackson tracks. <laughs> That's just because of the quirkiness of it. Definitely something you you want to check out if you're a Michael Jackson fan. Or were. Or, or were, either or. Get out of my way. Michael. Graphically, it's it's a middle mid tier graphic. Graphically, the game is mid tier, meaning C graphics. It's not really that much to write home about. <clears throat> the music though is what makes this game really good. Gameplay, it's just your generic average, you know, beat 'em up. I would call it a beat 'em up, <clears throat> or maybe your action game. I don't know. I'm not real sure what to call this, but. So where did we miss somebody? Oh, other than that, I'd actually suggest playing through it. Although this is one of those Genesis games that costs a lot of money to emulate it. If you get, if you really want to play it, just emulate it. Or if you know somebody that makes cartridges like I do, 
You can always get a reproduction of it. I have a four and one myself. I can't remember what else is on that. Anyway, that's another story for another time, though. See if we go back down and maybe, yep, see what we missed. I cannot find that other one. I think I've gone too far down. <clears throat> Thank goodness there's no time limit because you may have to come back to this a few times just to figure out what you missed. Oh, by the way, if you're on a six button controller, X, Y, and Z don't do anything. A, B, and C are the buttons you want. So play this with a three button controller, people. Or you'll have buttons that literally don't do anything. <clears throat> okay, I can't find this other person. Definitely wouldn't fall out a window, I wouldn't think. <clears throat> Let's go back and check again. Honestly, I don't think you I don't think they're here. I've checked every door. I've even gone back downstairs. I found nothing, everybody. I've already cleared this part of it, I think. <clears throat> so my last guess is actually very true here they're hiding in a window how would I get up there though I can't I'm stuck I can't do anything until I find that last person oh what the hell yeah, I didn't do it, obviously, but... <clears throat> I don't know if you'll get stuck like this, but I always do when I play this. This is the part where I tend to get stuck. We will play until we lose all of our lives. I'm not even sure where I missed somebody. Oh, well, not there, obviously. There it is. I wanted to show that before we got anywhere else. <laughs> Wait until we get enough enemies on screen, though. That's when you want to do it. When the screen is full of enemies. You just hit A and, <clears throat> hold A and B for a certain amount of time, and he, they all start dancing. Oh! Excuse me. Oh, get off. on this has got to be some sort of a joke i can't seem to find the the last person i need here but 
We're gonna play through one more time and see if we can find it. Now watch, I have enough people on screen here. Let's see if I can make it happen. Nope. Oh wait, yeah, here we go. And the music's different for every level too. Michael Jackson wins. Dance Tality. <clears throat> oh, this game looks familiar. Yeah, we've covered this one before. <clears throat> just wanted I just had to feature it here in this series too. What the hey? I've also done the master system for it too, so this one, like I said in that video, is much better. I almost feel like I missed somebody down there because there's people coming from down there too. Oh, they come from all over the land to try and kill me. Why would you be chilling down here? Them, I almost expected there to be a kid down there. There they are. Okay. Now you tell me. <clears throat> oh, he wants me to go up. Bubbles, the monkey wants me to get up. Up again, say, say you, Bubbles? Okay. Bubster. Up another flight of stairs. Pointing up again. Okay, this way? Okay, got it. Oh, I won't? Now get off my screen, boy. Don't do anything stupid. Like this. <laughs> that did nothing. See? Told you not to do anything stupid. And that's why. Well, at least we were almost able to complete the level. Anyway, I'll be right back with my next game in just a So our next game, I actually have a copy of it. I've had it for a while now. But again, this is about the game, not about your host. <laughs> anyway, <clears throat> our winner for my favorite game on the Genesis is... Coming up in... And we're back in this is the game that I have chosen for my favorite game on the Genesis. It should be obvious to anybody who's been with this channel long enough. This is American Gladiators. My favorite show of all time and my favorite game of all time on the Genesis, that is. Now, of course, my girl Zell must... My girl Zell, shout out to Zell slash Abby, already knows that American Gladiators is my favorite show. So, of course, she was going to figure that I was going to pick this one. How fitting that I'm wearing red, white, and blue, as usual. Because that's the colors of the outfit. I don't know if the music seems slow to anyone else. By the way, I've already reviewed this, so I'm not going to do a re-review. We're just going to play through it. I'm not going to explain how it's played either. I've already done that. You, I'll, I'll put... I'll put a link to my first review of American Gladiators on Genesis. It's one of the very first videos, if not the first video I ever did. Back when the channel started in 2014. Damn, it's been that long. I may have done another one for this... A few years ago, actually. Or more, less than that, actually. Anyway. I will not explain how the events work, because like I said, in one of the reviews, I... Actually, I did that in one of the playthroughs, so... Go check out Friday Night Gladiators if you want to know how this stuff works. Funnel gets shut out. Cool.
Okay, now the music sounds normal. Eddie's down. Another 10 points from me. <coughs> 15 to 5. So Bob got some points. Let's see if I can smoke this wall. Not in the way I wanted to, but I think I'm going to get up first. Yes, I am. Another 10 points. <clears throat> 25 10 lead going into one of my favorite events, Atmosphere. And that's because this game is is so easy to score. And as you see me do that, do it within the first second of the match, literally. Yeah, we're rolling along. Got seven. I've got a fast start. Literally rolling along and metaphorically. Got plenty of time to get some more goals. That's what I'm going to try to do. Oh, I think I'd have had 10 had I not run out of time. Look how close that was. 34-18 lead. Alright. Let's see what we do in Powerball. I'm only going to play one round of this tournament format. This should be up today alongside the other half of this video. It's all going to be one video, though, obviously. I'm not planning on doing another one of these today. I was, but I don't, don't think I will. I'll try to get one in tomorrow before I go hang out with Zell. So if I don't, so be it. I'll do it on Sunday. Sunday is this is being recorded, that is. That's going to be the last attempt I get at scoring. An 8-8 tie. <laughs> I believe that's the first time I've seen a tie in Powerball, but it doesn't matter. I've still got the lead. He's having trouble on the treadmill over there, and I'm already halfway across the bike at least. Eliminator butt kicking, folks. This is a route. And that will close it out. So again, American Gladiators gets gets my favorite game on the Genesis. And your and your honorable mention goes to Michael Jackson's Moonwalker, everybody. I want to let this finish out, and then it's about time I said goodbye. So, like, comment, subscribe, and you know what? I'll see you guys again soon for more. Bye-bye.